when I got into IT by accident, actually, when I graduated in 1966 from university, I have a science background, so in those days, jobs were not easy to come by. And I applied to IBM, I got a job in IBM, and I really didn't know what programming or computers was until I got into IBM. I was one of the people who started the Computer Society, and you know, from then on, it began to build up. I got, it, got involved in the uh, executive committee, I became its president, and I got involved in the regional. You, know, you get involved in all the activities of IT. In those days, when I started in 1960s, 70s, 80s, there were not too many people. All of us chipped in to try and promote the IT industry. I've also developed a lot of uh, friends and colleagues in the IT industry, not just in Singapore, but internationally. And it's enabled me to be able to now help uh, our startup companies to establish contacts in those countries. Well, IT is very pervasive, and I think it will not go away. It will, in fact, be really a part of life of everybody. So we all have to now accept IT, adapt IT.